hello welcome back to my channel this is fame ebong today i want to teach you guys how to produce a black shoe polish these will be the ingredients i'll be using i'll be making use of beeswax i'm using 52 grams of beeswax and this is the solvent i'll be using i'm making use of paraffin oil 75 grams of paraffin oil you can use any oil you can use any oil but i'm using paraffin oil and i'll be adding soap i want my polish to have a glossy appearance a shiny and glossy appearance that's the purpose of soap and this is charcoal this is the regular charcoal that you get from firewood you just gather the charcoal grate it blend it into fine powder and use it for your shoe polish And over here are my empty polish containers. I actually bought these containers. I emptied the content in them for the purpose of this video so that I will have where I can put my polish after I have produced mine. So that was how I got those containers. I emptied them from previous polish content. And this is my stainless pot. So I want to start melting everything. I'll be melting everything on fire that is my oil don't forget you can use any oil you can use coconut oil or you can use paraffin oil any clear oil is good for this project the paraffin oil is good because it's very cheap it's cheap in term in compared to the coconut oil and this is my beeswax you can use any wax of your choice you can also use paraffin wax that wax used for making hair cream you can use that wax also so if you don't have beeswax use paraffin wax for this project this method of making black shoe polish is also used in the same method they use in making brown shoe polish the only difference is the color like for this black shoe polish I'm making use of a black color which is the charcoal if you want it to come out brown then you add a brown color you can add cocoa powder if you want it to come out yellow you can add turmeric powder but also these colors are not limited to these powders if you need other colors you can go to the chemical shop where they sell chemicals for soap and purchase oil soluble colors don't forget you can purchase chemical and uh, colors used for making soap but make sure it is oil soluble color just in case you don't have access to turmeric powder cocoa powder but you can find those alternative in oil soluble color at soap shop or chemical shops just purchase them and use them for your shoe polish but make sure they are oil soluble color because they need to dissolve in the paraffin oil oil soluble colors dissolve in oil next thing that i will be doing i will keep this aside for it to cool down right now it is very hot and watery but while it is cooling down it will, be, it will start becoming hard and the temperature will be returning back to a normal temperature so once it has cooled down and it has become hard it is ready for use your shoe polish is ready so this can take like an hour to cool down and become hard so after one hour, this is the result. Our polish has cooled down, the temperature has cooled down, then it is hard. It is hard, it is now hard inside the container. You can see I've placed it upside down, it's not falling out. We are going to experiment this 
on our shoes here to see how wonderful this polish is Thank you all for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to share it with others that will be interested in learning how to make a shoe polish at home. And also it is good for business. Don't forget to also join my online class to check the video description to join my online class. You will learn a lot there. Goodbye and see you all next time on our next video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so that you'll be updated by our new videos. Bye.